I've only been carving for about three years. I was doing wood turning before that, which was making bowls with lids and decided to start decorating them a little. And that's what got me into the wood carving and the wood burning. I've always uh, loved anything to do with wood. I carry a pocket knife and I'll be sitting around making hickory whistles, if nothing else. I, I just enjoy anything to do with woodworking. I'm Ernie Poindexter and I do wood carving. I do it as a hobby to begin with, but I enjoy doing these art shows also. But as a construction worker, and I was a maintenance supervisor at Salisaw Schools for a number of years, and I didn't have time to do anything other than work and <laughs> rest up a little in between. Mm -hmm. I've always uh, liked art and stuff, even though I never had a single art class in school that I can remember even in high school. But uh, it's always been something I've enjoyed. But like I say, I was so busy in my professional life that there was no time to go see art shows or anything else or to even enjoy myself. So I really feel privileged to have this retirement and a hobby that I like so much. I won the Trail of Tears Award this year and the piece is called uh, Removal Gathering. And I made it to where it looked like an armed guard was guarding a group of Indians sleeping on the ground and they were gonna remove them the next day up to a stockade and prepare them to put them on the Trail of Tears and remove them. I, I was thinking, uh, what would it be like for someone with a rifle to gather you up and get you in a group and hold you against your will? Right? This uh, wood that I made this out of is an ash tree. And when I get my wood in, it's a stick of firewood and I split it, I, I trim it down, I keep working with it till I get it into a block that I can actually draw on to get my pattern into it, make sure everything's gonna fit, and then I'll go to carving, and then sometimes I do change in midstream. When I see something's not going to work correctly, I'll, I'll change a little bit, but usually I can get it to come out. That piece, uh, starting from a block of wood, it takes at least one year because you have to dry that wood and uh, it carves easier when it's moist or it's green wood or raw wood, some people call it. But I, uh, as you go down and keep getting it thinner, it dries quicker. But a two inch piece of wood would take up to two years to dry. So that one, I had to get all of that done and dried in one year because that's the rules of the show. You have to make it after the previous show and time to get it checked in. Takes every minute of it. <laughs> I'm still excited about winning this prize because I, I never thought that I would. I never thought I'd get to that point. And at the age that I am, I don't know how many years I'll be doing this. So I'm gonna try to keep going as long as I can. I feel privileged to be in here with so many great artists because, I mean, there's some good artists in this uh, Cherokee show here. And it amazes me. I never walk through the gallery that I don't find something that just blows me away. You know, I'm ex so excited to see it and it's great. It just gets better and better. Uh, these artists it surprise me, what they can come up with and how good they are at it. And it's just an amazing, amazing thing to be involved with. It makes you feel good. Thank mm -hmm. you.